correct. An award-winning officer has been told that he's being fired. Officer Daniel Bo Jones was one of the top drug enforcement officers on the force. But on Monday, the Phoenix Police Department says they intend to fire him while he's under a criminal investigation. Team 12's Michael Doudna joins us now in the Alert Center with the story. Yeah, guys, Daniel Bo Jones has spent 19 years on the force. His personnel file is full of good reviews, but lawsuits against the officer paint a different picture. Daniel Bo Jones, uh, has been notified that he will be terminated. The veteran police officer decorated as part of a national drug team now set to be fired. Jones personnel file leaves rave reviews of an officer whose team in just one year seized almost 4,200 pounds of marijuana and almost $500,000 in cash. So why is a sergeant like this now on the chopping block and under criminal investigation. To be honest with you, I don't have a lot of information about Bo Jones's case in that matter. I know that it's a criminal investigation and I don't want to uh, uh, interfere with that. Lawsuits filed against Jones and other officers that the city later settled paint a different picture. Back in 2007, a lawsuit filed by a fellow police officer accuses Jones of harassment, calling her a slew of nasty and sexist names. And other times, he would threaten her with a taser, aiming and activating it. The lawsuit also alleges Jones would brag about beating suspects. Now, these civil cases against Jones eventually did settle. But Officer Jones is now in the hot seat under a criminal investigation. The internal investigation is already over as Phoenix PD plans to fire him. Right now with Bo Jones, I don't have any other information. I've given you what I have. We've terminated him or noti notified him he's going to be terminated. And that's where we're at. Now, we did reach out to Sergeant Jones, and when he answered the phone, well, he hung up after learning we were from 12 News. Now, the Phoenix Police Department told us shortly before the show that settlements do not indicate fault and are, quote, not evidence of an employee's good or bad performance. The department has offered no details about the ongoing criminal investigation. We're live here in the Alert Center. Michael Doudna, 12 News. Okay, Michael.